Have you seen Paul? And, uh, Has anybody seen Paul? Yeah, Where's Paul? Just, just let me know what this is. Then. Paul? Paul? Where's Paul? Have you seen Paul? No, no. Has anybody seen Paul? Marco. What? What are you, what are you doing there? Wait, what? I, I had to move so somebody could walk by. I hear you Paul had to move so, so wait, so and I think I got stuck. Are you stuck? I think I got stuck. Wait, let's see. So what? You two people can't walk by the space? No. I had to move so somebody could get by. Let's see. Paul, grab, grab. <laughs> you legitimately got stuck. What, what was that? I think this plug stuck my arm. <laughs> I really hope 39 First Avenue winds up being available and not some $15,000 BS. This is right now. Look at this. You have, to, you have to go this way, then that way, then this way. <laughs> what? Yeah, so to, to move, you have to go there, then here. Then, when you get to this part, you're gonna hit here. This casing sticks out, so you have to kind of move to the side to get through here. I want a new store, Paul. Yes, please. When do we get a new store? Soon. Please? Soon? Yeah? You think he'll rent it, or do you think he's gonna keep it vacant until somebody decides to pay the ripoff $15,000? $15,000 a week? Fifteen thousand a month. That's how much the shoe store wanted, right? It was like fifteen thousand a week. The shoe store wanted twenty-seven thousand dollars, twenty-five or twenty-seven thousand a month for a tiny little ass space. It was actually marginally larger than this one. Yeah. I guess Let's see what's going on in the bathroom, in the backyard back here. What's this? Oh, nice es excavator that's about to excavate our wall. <laughs> what happens if the hydraulic br if the hydraulics give out on this? If, uh, I don't know if the, the turning of this thing is controlled by hydraulics, but it's just parked here with it up in the air. If that decide, if that valve decides to go, that thing's going to come crashing through my seat. 30 hertz. This is an amazing desk. Yeah. <laughs> it would be if I had time to clean. Yeah, if you get an aerial view of Paul's desk, it's actually quite impressive. Hey everybody, so this is about nine blocks away from my existing store. My store is up that way on First Avenue. And this here looks like exactly what I need. So it has a similar layout to my store, except the ceilings are higher. It's about, I would say, three times as wide as my existing store. Probably three times as wide, maybe about 20 feet longer, and it's completely empty, and yeah, it can use some work, but a little bit of renovation. This looks beautiful. I'm... Steve and I were actually walking by this the other day on the way to dinner, and he, he suggested I've circled back around it. Actually quite hopeful that this is not going to be some place that's like twenty or $30,000 a month or some BS like that. But this is really nice. This would... It would be really cool to have a business where I don't feel claustrophobic all the time, the way I currently do in the trying to fit 12 people in the little dump I got now. Man, this would be nice. Alright, see you in the next one.